but the best application of artificial intelligence, I believe, is for cybersecurity. Hi, I'm Melvin Fong. I work with GD Express Berhad, a public listed company known as GDEX in Malaysia. I'm currently the Chief Information Officer, leading the IT team and also business strategy. GDEX is the leading delivery company in the region with a headcount of more than 10,000. GDEX has always been a very technology-focused company. When I first started in IT, I uh, was spent in digital forensic and I consider myself to be lucky because uh, in this new digital age, cybersecurity has been one of a needed skill, I would say, for a CIO to actually make an informed decision to safeguard their companies. Everyone is rushing towards digital transformation. There, there seems to be some lack of support in terms of uh, keeping the cybersecurity to catch up to the pace of the transformation. With remote workings and all this coming to place, the traditional systems and the traditional architecture doesn't work anymore. Adversaries, they are becoming more unique, uh, more advanced. From the first day that silence was uh, big, available in Malaysia, it has been applied to those companies that I've been working with. And the decision is not just about me believing in silence, it's about the team that do the testing, the one that do the proof of concept, that also believes in the technology. And it's also the management that can see the results of after implementing silence. And uh, from that day onwards, I've been encouraging people to look into AI. Not, not just silence, of course, but AI. AI works. Claims, claims are actually from vendors who sell things, but we have, we have to do our own research. To look at an AI, I believe in maturity. I know silence have been the first AI for many years. Many players in the market now are EDRs. It means detect and response, which means something happened, you pick it up and you respond to it. But when we first know about silence, it's all about preventive. You don't even need to trigger the file. I just don't have confidence if I just implement a normal EDR. I will still prefer uh, AI is behind it. When we make a comparison with the traditional AV that we replace, after deploying, they can't detect certain things. And then, you know, those things actually give us more problems. And I need a lot of support staff to handle those problems. After we change it, you know, to BlackBerry Silence, and I, I only need one guy, you know, have a look at the dashboard. There's no more problems in the endpoints. There's no such thing as, you know, possible ransomware or Trojans or anything. We don't get any issues after that.